calling in blessings for everyone as we travel through these last few days before we reach new moon in Scorpio on the 13th. I have quite a few sacred herbs that are burning in this cauldron here. I have cedar, I have palo santo, I have mugwort, lavender, rose petals, bay leaf, silver sage, yarrow, rose geranium, tobacco, <laughs> and I'm sending you this smoke to cleanse you of the old story and the false limitations that have been taken into the consciousness and allow all of these things to be cleared away by this smoke now. Allow everything that separates you from the truth that you are creator, that the creative force is always accessible to you and that you can create the way forward that's in harmony with your passion and your purpose and all you have to do is open yourself to trust that you do have this power, that it does run through you and to claim it now in this moment in harmony with great spirit, in harmony with all and for all. And that as you activate this force within you and you let the road behind you drift away into what was so you can step into what will be, what will be according to the creativity that will funnel through you now, then you will clearly see the path with heart and it will rise up to meet you just open your heart to trust that things can be beautiful, that you can be blessed, that there's enough for all, and that you rejoice in accepting the blessings that are coming your way now as you let all the heavy energy go. Just let that shit go, man. Because it's the lie that you have to live in a state of lack or anger or grief or loss. It's a lie. You don't have to live in that place. You don't have to make lack a home. You can come into a place of fullness and joy and sweetness and blessing and prosperity, serenity, tranquility, ease. You don't have to grow through hardship, even within the times when there is loss, even in times of grief. You can simply give yourself over to the experience and allow it to be a sweet release of letting go. Even in the darkest corridors of transition, there's always some little light to be found. And I ask that you are connected with that light and that that light grows, even though it may just start an ember. I pray that it grows for you and it grows into the very thing that will ignite your heart with passion and purpose and light your way forward to the path that brings you blessings and smooth passage to the destiny that is ready to be claimed by you now. And for you to recognize that you do have this power. You do have this power to create. You do have this power to set yourself free. You do have this power and you don't have to wait for it. Activate it now. Claim it now. And I ask that the musing inspiration comes through you and awakens this in you now and in the days to come so that once you reach new moon on the 13th, you will be ready to transform your life and part those dark curtains to the bright road ahead. It is so in harmony with all and for all, in alignment with the will of great spirit. It is so. Amen. Ashe. Amin.